Create one compound path of many paths. It has one color and it's overlapping each other. The usual method. I have five overlapping paths here. Select all paths. Go to object tab then select expand appearance. Go to object tab again then select compound path then make. Usually we do this method and it creates holes on our design. But I found another way to create a compound path. Let's undo this until we have the paths again. Go to object tab then select expand appearance. Go to window tab then select pathfinder. Then click unite. Now we have a compound path. Here's the second method. Select all paths. Go to object tab and select expand appearance. While still selected, select the shape builder tool. Left click the mouse and build shape inside the paths. Be careful when building a shape. When you accidentally include the blank space inside, it will create a fill. Let's undo this until we have the expanded appearance. Make sure that we only select the parts that needs to be united. Click the selection tool and select the path. The compound path is within the group. To remove it, click Ctrl 8. Now we created a compound path. Create two compound paths of many paths. It has two colors in one design. Select all paths. Click Ctrl G to group. Then click Ctrl C to copy and Ctrl F to paste it in front. Now lock the first group. While the second group is selected, click the Shape Builder tool and click the inside to make a shape. Now click the Selection tool. Open the group. Hide the first group. Locate the shape built on the second group and lock it then hide. Then press Delete. Unhide the shape and then unlock it. And also unlock the first group. Now select the shape. Change it to fill by clicking on the arrow. Change its color. Click Ctrl 8 to create a compound path. Unhide the first group. Place the shape below it. Now lock the shape. Select all paths. Click object then expand appearance. Click window then select pathfinder. Click unite. Unlock it. Now we have two compound paths. One is a line art. One is a shape. Create two compound paths from one path. It has two colors in one design. I have a design here with a yellow fill and black stroke. Now select the shape. Then go to object tab, expand appearance. Go to object tab, compound path then make. Notice that the colors are gone. To avoid this, let's undo it first by clicking Ctrl Z. While still selected, click Ctrl C to copy then Ctrl F to paste it in front. Now select one shape then remove its fill and leave its stroke. Now select other shape then remove its stroke and leave its fill. Now we have a shape with a fill only. And a shape with a stroke only. Now let's select the shape with a stroke path only. Go to object tab then select expand appearance. Go to window tab then select pathfinder then click unite. Now we have a compound path. Select the shape with a fill only and click Control 8. Now we have two compound paths. Create two compound paths from many paths. It has two colors in multiple design. I have some identical designs here. And it's all in a separate group. I want all the blacks to be in one compound path. And also the yellow ones, to have a one compound path. Now what I'll do is, select all groups. Then right click the mouse. And select ungroup. Now all the paths are ungrouped. I'll hold the shift while selecting all the black paths. Now click Ctrl 8 to create a compound path. Now let's hide this compound path and lock it. Now select all the yellow shapes. Now click Ctrl 8 to create a compound path. Now we have two compound paths. One is color black. And one is color yellow. 